Uh, welcome to Foundry Day, put on by Wapaka and the MSC department here. Uh, they, had, they brought their mini cupola, which is a type of furnace to melt iron. This is a scale of five to ten times smaller than the, what they're usually operating in the foundry. Uh, today, students have the opportunity to scratch some molds, put whatever design they like into a Kenban mold. Uh, we'll pack it, we'll cast it for them, and then they are going to be able to take home uh, a keepsake from uh, Foundry Day. Uh, Wapaka is going to be fueling the cupola with coke and scrap iron, and then they will uh, pump it with uh, oxygen, and that's how this uh, furnace burns. Uh, it can easily reach temps of 1500 to 2000 degrees C which is definitely hot enough to melt iron. And it's been a real great experience for the students to see what an uh, average day in a foundry looks like. Dump it, dump it, dump it. All right, go. Uh, so right now we're making some scratch blocks, which are just some sand molds that you can scratch into, whether it be a drawing, you can write some words down, and from that we'll go over there and put them onto the casting line and fill them with, up with cast iron, and we'll cool them off and you can pick them up a little bit later. Okay, so over here we're building the charges, and that consists of we're weighing out the correct amount of scrap iron into the smaller buckets and weighing them up. Then we take a separate bucket and weigh up the coke charge, which is roughly right now we're doing 40 pounds of iron to 10 pounds of the coke. And then we're adding one pound of limestone to that coke charge and setting it off to the side for them to dump into the furnace. And yeah, that's how we're building the charges. Uh, so my name is Tyler Noyan. Um, graduated from Tech in 2003. Uh, started here in 98. Uh, started out general engineering, did mechanical for a semester, and then ended up in material science. When I first got out of school, I actually went and worked for a small centrifugal foundry in southern Wisconsin. And then about 20 years ago, I uh, moved to Wapaka, for Wapaka in Wapaka at the gray iron facilities. Started out as a metallurgist, then did Six Sigma continuous improvement, then quality manager, um, then a assistant plant manager. Also got my MBA along the way, um, was head of research and process development for a little while, chose to go back to the operations side. My first experience with Foundry was actually at Mercury Marine when I was on a co-op as a Michigan Tech student and just really got hooked by seeing the molten metal become something useful in a part.